Hello, in this video we are going to add a web map service to our QGIS project. First I need some background reference. I use the OSM standard from the Quick Map Services plugin. We are going to add the ESA world cover layer, which is a 10 meters land cover map of the whole world. And we are going to add it as a web map service. It is provided in WMTS and WMS format. And we are going to use the WMTS because it is a bit more efficient, it has tiles. So I'm going to copy the link. You can also click right and choose copy from your browser. I used Ctrl C here so I can paste it with Ctrl V. In the data source manager, go to WMS slash WMTS and create a new connection. I'm calling this connection ESA World Cover 2020. And I paste the link from the web service. Click OK and click connect. Now it loads the layers from that uh, server. And we're going to use the World Cover 2020 map layer. If I make it a bit wider, you can see here how it's provided in which projection. Click Add, and it will load in our project. So here we have it. Remember that a WMS or WMTS uh, is a rendered picture of the data, so it's not the real data. We also see that this one doesn't come with a legend, so we're going to do a little trick to add a legend. We go to the World Cover Viewer, and there it uh, prints in this viewer a legend, and I make a screenshot of that and save it to a file. Then I go to the layer properties of our World Cover Map in QGIS and go to the Legend tab, and there I can add it as a legend placeholder image. And now I have the legend added and can see it in our layers panel. So in this video you've learned how to connect to a web map service from QGIS and to add a legend if that's not present. <music>